Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'd originally opened this video when I filmed it, but I had the shower running in the background and you couldn't even hear me at all. So here we are. I'm currently editing and that's why I was like, what the heck, I can't post this. In this video, I'm just showing you guys kind of how I shop for my clothes, where I go and all that good stuff. Yeah, if you're interested in that, just keep watching. Ciabatta bread, egg, goo, uh, smoked gouda, and yeah, that's all. And then I have my coffee. I hope you like that little clip. I wanted to try something new. I'm speaking softly because I don't know who's awake. Let's try this though. Potatoes first. Oh, there's mom. Now my sandwich. Okay, so I'm already my fit today. As for jewelry, this is from Vitali, Mahaba Vintage. This is the ring I got for my girlfriend and I. This shirt is from Zara. These pants are from Zara and these are Nike Sages. We're gonna go to Zara. As you can tell, this is my favorite place to shop. I just want to try and find some outfits for my girlfriend's birthday. We're going to Chicago, so I need to be Fitted. She's gonna look nice and I always like matching her. I don't know if I'm gonna be filming in Zara I'll try to show you guys uh, what I try to look out for in there, but I'll do a haul when I come home Hopefully I find some good things. So we just went to the Grove and I only found one shirt there There was a lot of items that were okay But I wasn't in love with and then the ones that I did love they were like 90 80 dollars So I was like, yeah, not that one but now we're going to uh, Glendale Mall. We're gonna go to the Zara and H&M there. So hopefully I can find something. And Aisha's gonna get her nails did. Yes. Uh, but first we're gonna eat because we're fucking starving. Mm-hmm. And yeah, that's all. That's all, we hungry. And we made it to our next location. Hopefully there's good Sorry. stuff here. Okay, so we just finished. I only got three things. I'll show you guys once I'm home. I'm not too happy with the shopping day today, but I mean, they're decent things that I could put pretty good outfits together for, like basic outfits, nice ones. Um, but I'll see what I have home and we'll see what I'm gonna pack for Chicago. Okay, so I'm finally home. I only got four things, got three shirts. Uh, two of them are the same, and then a pair of pants. So I'm gonna try them on for you. The first one is this, this like gray blue polo shirt. It's very stretchy, but I feel like it's gonna fit me like pretty tight. Okay, so here is the first shirt. I like that it's stretchy and it snugs on my arm, but. Yeah, here it is. I l I've been digging collared shirts lately. More so like the button up collarless shirts, but the shirts with collars, I like the ones that stop right here. But this shirt, I feel like I can make a couple outfits out of like these pants. And then I got the same two shirts. So I got a black and white one, but this one goes all the way down and it's collarless. It's a small, but I think I'm gonna hem the uh, sleeves a little myself because I don't like how long it goes. I'll probably hem it like that, this length. And then I could also tuck it in, but yeah. Oh, actually it's not the same. I thought it was the same thing. Awesome. So this one is a collarless and it ends right here, but I'll probably do the same thing. Or actually, I don't know, I think I just need bigger arms for this one. But I like this one a lot more, I think, than the black one. Let me button it up. Yeah, this one, I definitely like it better. And then I can tuck it in, whatnot, whatever. Yeah, but this is what I got. I've been liking uh, button ups recently. I want to dress more uh, fancier. 
fancier per se. Uh, I still love my streetwear, of course, but... And then I got these pants. I like the wash of them. I already tried them on. I got a size too big, uh, but I can probably fix it myself. Um, but let me show you all my closet. So I honestly don't have too many clothes. These are the clothes I'm selling on Depop. I'll have it linked below. And then I just kind of have like uh, basics over here. I have my like coat. I have my chaos stuff. But then I have like my my shackets. It's like a shirt jacket and then a collared shirt. These are my girlfriends. Uh, my girlfriend gave me these. <laughs> But these are some cargos I wear, corduroy, these are my fancy pants, leather pants, and then I have just like my jeans, some more corduroy. But I kind of just based my outfits on my shoes and my pants, like today, uh, the outfit that I'm wearing, like my fancier pants and then my Air Forces. Usually I pick out either or my shoe or my pants. Today I picked out my pants, I really wanted to wear these, and then it was either my sages or my ones that I was going to wear. But then I chose these because of the shirt I wanted to wear. Uh, so yeah, I kind of just based all my pants off my pants and my shoes. I don't really care for shirts. That's why I have like so many basics because I like, like the cargo pants. I like the corduroys. Uh, and then I like certain washes of jeans. I of course love black jeans, but, um, I like like the very light wash pants. Most of my closet though is all neutrals. I don't really wear any color besides the green. Um, but yeah, a lot of you guys just ask where I buy my clothes and it's mostly just Zara and H&M. Uh, I feel like cause those are the two shops that the men's clothing fits me really good. Other shops like, let's say Forever 21, they never have pants or shorts that fit me. Yeah, just a lot of stores that I've tried don't really have pants my size besides. I will say um, American Eagle's pants, that's where I started buying my jeans. American Eagle because they have so many different sizes and it was really easy to find my size there. They're definitely more pricey jeans, but they last me forever. Um, but they have so many different sizes. So I was really comfortable wearing jeans from American Eagle. And then once I wasn't so nervous to shop in the men's section, then I started venturing off a little bit. Um, but it was definitely nerve wracking to do at first. When I first started going to the men's section, I had to always have someone go with me because I was, I was so scared and I didn't know what sizes to get. Obviously in shirts, like I knew my size, but pants, I had no idea what to get. And I didn't know if it was gonna look good on me, if it was gonna fit me right. So yeah, I always had someone go with me. and. I still, sometimes if there's a lot of men in the certain section that I'm in, shopping in, um, I do get a little nervous, like now it's a little easier. I've been doing it for quite some time, but it was definitely scary to do at first. Um, I s definitely have gone many stairs, but now I don't really care. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. My drop for the Chaos Tote Bags is gonna be on April 22nd, Earth Day, my baby girl's birthday and it's gonna be at 1 p.m. PST. So have your alarms ready for that because it is very limited. I only have one box full um, and I don't know when I'm gonna launch them again. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a like because I had a terrible shopping day, but I'll try to vlog another trip to the mall whenever I go next. Comment down below what kind of videos you guys want to see from me and I'll see you in the next video.